Light on. Couple a little bit edgy. He lets them go though, and they all got out to a pretty good line in the end. Dawning Decision was one of the first to show out. Scudetto, the Albion, Canada Bay, Collison are all pushing forward, prancing in the rain. Dawning Decision in that division. Captain George is right there. Just getting off those then was to the point now as they just bunch up a touch. Getting back then, Flash Free Oronte, Rupert's Delight, and Super Famous, the last one. So finding their order inside the seven. Canada Bay went through to lead. About two in front in second spot, Collison. The Albion's running third out a little bit deep. Getting up on the inside, the favourite Captain George. He couldn't got a better run. Scudetto behind those dawning decision down the side from to the point. Well back in the field then, coming to the turn was prancing in the rain. Rupert's Delight getting back off those Super Famous. And the last one was Flash Free Oronte. Canada Bay, Captain George, they come around the turn together. Collison deeper out on the track, tries to run on, dawning decision. And then behind those, the Albion, and behind them to the point, but the favourite, Captain George, he broke clear. He looked home, battling away. Collison getting home late to the point. Canada Bay and dawning decision. But it's an easy one to Captain George, and Captain George goes on to win it well. Wins it by two on the line to Collison. To the point, got up to get third. And then just in behind those, then was Canada Bay, dawning decision, the Albion. Well back prancing in the rain. Scudetto, Rupert's delight, well back in the field with Flash for Yaronte and Super Famous will be the last one in. It's a nice performance. Number one, Captain George, favourite, way too good. He deserved the win. And he got a beautiful run this afternoon from Jared Todd. And he was able to really control that from the midway stage. He tried hard and he was able to come away late to score in pretty nice order. Collison, nice first up performance in Darwin. He got home quite well and to the point who was always pretty deep on the track and midfield throughout has run on well to get into third spot as we wait for these interims 10282 the time nice run and we stand by for fourth to be posted there but uh, interims are coming through 1 2 11 won the winner captain george jared todd for gary clark second two collis and adam nichols for neil dyer and third went to 11 to the point jade hampson chloe baxter fourth to number nine and that was Canada Bay, Sonia Logan, Tommy Logan in front of 10. Dawning decision, Aaron Sweeney for Gary Clark. So 1, 2, 11, 9, 10, 1, 0, 2, 8, 2 the time. The winner is a five-year-old Bale Brown Gelding, Vancouver, Keller Sam for Charlene Clark, A. Reberg, Kevin King, B.J. Hazelman, M.A. Lont, N.T. Smith, uh, Marion, Marilyn and S. Uh, Gladwin there with S. Hazelman, S.M. Uh, Dorgan, J.M. Church, C. Smith, A. Uh, Gazanti, K.J. Brett Hower, uh, Trev Gladwin's in the ownership, and M.J. Dillon. Trained by Gary Clark, Jared Todd, just proving just a little bit too strong this afternoon. Second goes to number two, that was Collison, a five year old Bay Gelding, written to Kunal Gore Raquel for Neil Dyer, Adam Nichols, and third went to 11, to the point, and to the point. Should know he's breeding. A five-year-old bay gelding, ball point, a little bit of class. Named after his owner. Trained by Chloe Baxter, Jade Hampson. Fourth to nine, fifth to ten. We stand by for correct weight.